Live from downtown St. Joseph, you're watching News Press Now. Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight for News Press Now. I'm Charles Christian. Well, as inflation begins to moderate, two new issues could impact families who struggle to put food on the table. The closing of Smithfield Hog Farms in northwest Missouri could impact the economy in some far-flung counties served by Second Harvest Community Food Bank. At the same time, able-bodied adults soon have to meet new work requirements in order to qualify for Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, or SNAP, or SNAP I should say, formerly known as food stamps. The Second Harvest CEO says pantries and distribution sites are already seeing high demand. You know, we'll continue to have resources um, outside of SNAP that we support through local pantries and mobile distributions and some of those kind of things. But um, it's, it's definitely going to be an adjustment for some of the families we're working with, and we'll do what we can to continue to monitor that and support families as best we can. The age limit for SNAP benefits increased to 50 on September 1st for able-bodied adults without children. It goes to 54 next year. 